Hey, it's Alan. Welcome. All right. In their uh, infinite wisdom, Apple has decided to stop including Java in recent versions of Mac. So if you're using a recent version of Mac OS, you'll need to install it yourself. Again, to uh, find out what version you're using, you'll want to click the little Apple icon in the upper left corner and choose About This Mac. This is Mac OS Big Sur. I know for sure that doesn't come with it. In fact, it doesn't have it on it yet. The Catalina version of Mac OS also doesn't come with it pre-installed. Another way to check is to go click that Apple icon again and pick System Preferences. And look around in here to see if you see Java. If Java isn't an option in your System Preferences, then that tells you it's probably not installed though with these newer versions. It may be installed and not shown up there. But for now, let's just assume that um, it's not installed. So let's do the installation now. Um, I suggest you go out to, now you can do it from the Oracle site, but I found a way at adoptopenjdk.net. It seems a little easier. So I'm going to show you that method. When you get to the site, you can actually just click this latest release thing, but I always like to check click other platforms so I know exactly what I'm getting. The selected one with the LTS is a good one. Anytime you see LTS, it stands for limited term support, I think, but it's actually a, a long term support kind of thing rather than an experimental build. So I'm going to pick that one. The JVM is the code executor. Just stick with hotspot. And then down here, you can look at this operating system and architect texture, make sure you get exactly what you want. Mac OS X64. And then we come down here so you can see it's going to do the JDK 11 LTS. If I go with this and you want this package over on the right here, the dot PKG, click that and it should start download. Oh um, yeah. Click allow and it should download. I'm using Safari as my browser. So the download indicator is up here. Yours probably won't be this fast. I'd sped it up a little so you wouldn't have to wait. So when the download's complete, you can close the browser and open Finder. Go to your Downloads folder. And there's the file you want right there, the openjdk.pkg file. Just double click that and that should start the installation. Um, we'll click Continue. Continue. Agree. That's just saying you're not going to steal it or sell it and whatever not. Uh, hard disk is normal. Um, hopefully I remember my password. Yes, I did. That's your Mac password for installing stuff. Click install and it should just run itself. And then click close. And you can move the installer to trash. That's just the PKG file. Now to verify that it's installed, go ahead and click your spotlight thing, the magnifying glass, search for terminal and run your terminal app. Okay. And in there now you want to type Java space hyphen hyphen version and press enter. Now if you get an error message, that means it's not installed, but this isn't an error message. This is telling you what version you're using. So we're good. Okay. Now we can close up the terminal window. And just so you know, like if you go back and click Apple and hit system preferences, it's Java still doesn't show up in here. So with these newer versions, you can't rely on that as being your indicator. You have to go to terminal and check for the version. Of course, once you download the other things for this course, you'll have more things to play around with. So uh, see you back in the class.